In the shadows of a great empire, in the bustling city of ancient Rome, lived two young friends named Ethan and Marcus. They were both 12 years old and shared a love for adventure. They spent their days exploring the narrow streets, marveling at the grand architecture, and dreaming of becoming great warriors. One day, while wandering through the market, Ethan and Marcus stumbled upon a peculiar sight. A merchant was selling exotic animals, and among them was a small penguin named Brian. Ethan was instantly captivated by the unique creature, and with Marcus's encouragement, he convinced his parents to purchase Brian as their pet. Ethan and Brian quickly formed a strong bond. They would spend hours playing together, teaching Brian tricks, and imagining themselves on daring quests. Little did they know that their friendship would soon be tested in the most challenging way. One fateful afternoon, as Ethan and Marcus were exploring a different part of the city, they were ambushed by a group of bandits. In the chaos, Marcus was captured and sold into slavery. Ethan, devastated by the loss of his friend, vowed to rescue Marcus from his cruel fate. Determined to find Marcus, Ethan embarked on a perilous journey through the treacherous streets of Rome. He discovered that Marcus was taken to the infamous Colosseum, where he would be trained as a gladiator. Ethan knew he had to infiltrate the Colosseum and devise a plan to free his friend. With the help of a sympathetic servant, Ethan managed to disguise himself as a young recruit and gain entry into the training grounds. He endured grueling physical training, all the while keeping a watchful eye on Marcus. The days turned into weeks, and Ethan's determination never wavered. One night, as the moon shone brightly over the Colosseum, Ethan noticed an opportunity. The guards were occupied with a raucous celebration, and the gates to the gladiators' quarters were left unguarded. It was now or never. Ethan stealthily made his way to Marcus's cell, his heart pounding with anticipation. With a whispered plan, the two friends devised their escape. They knew they had to act quickly and silently to avoid detection. Together, Ethan and Marcus fought their way through the dark corridors of the Colosseum, dodging guards and navigating hidden passages. They could taste freedom, but danger lurked at every turn. Finally, they reached the outer walls of the Colosseum, just as the first rays of dawn illuminated the sky. With a final burst of energy, they scaled the walls and leaped into the safety of the city. Exhausted but triumphant, Ethan and Marcus returned home, where they were greeted with tears of joy by their families. Their friendship had been tested, but it had emerged stronger than ever. From that day forward, Ethan, Marcus, and Brian the Penguin were inseparable. They continued to dream of adventure, but now with the knowledge that together, they could overcome any obstacle.